threat priority in java programming what is threat priority the threat priority is a number assigned to a thread that is used by thread scheduler to decide which thread should be allowed to execute which means that once you create the more than one thread which thread will go for execution it is defined as thread priority then how it is possible we will see the thread priority is given by the jvm or else user or programmer itself because once threads has been created if it does not assign a thread priority number it assigned by the jvm or else if you want to create explicitly it is do by the programmer itself that thread priorities are represented a number from 1 to 10 because the minimum priority number would be 1 the maximum priority would be 10 here this thread will go for execution the highest priority e thread is selected by the thread scheduler to be say, executed first then lowest priority thread why the thread priority is required over here then once thread priority has been assigned to the threads the highest priority thread will executed first then lowest priority thread for example if both threads have the same priority how the threads will go for execution it is defined the it, it is depends on first come first serve which thread has been entered first that thread will go for execution okay that is the importance of the thread priority in java programming then see here the default priority of a thread is 5 which means that once thread has been created it doesn't assign any number then the default priority of the thread is 5 it is been assigned by the jvm or else if you want to assign a thread explicitly it is also possible the thread class majorly it provides three constants the min priority norm priority then max priority the min priority value would be 1 the norm priority value should be 5 the maximum priority value should be 10 these constants are public final and static please remember it okay by default those constants are public final and static members of a thread class if you want to ask by default it is a default priority thread because once thread has been created it is default normal priority if you want to assign a minimum priority or maximum priority you can do by the you can do explicitly okay then i will go for the execution with help of the execution you can easily understand uh, see here how been create the two threads then the first thread has been seted with the minimum priority the second thread assigned with the maximum priority okay if you does not give any priority number by default it is a normal priority then for the once first thread is assigned with the minimum priority the second thread is assigned with the maximum priority okay once thread has been started which thread will execute first okay the maximum priority thread will go for go execution first then the minimum priority thread once threads has been started the threads will call the run method then thread name which means that which current which thread is currently running if you want to get the name of the thread there is a method is called get name then if you want to get the priority then current thread dot get priority this method is used to get the priority number of a current running thread i will go for execution see here the thread name is called thread1 the thread1 has been executed first the priority number would be 10 after that the thread name thread0 the thread0 executed the thread priority equal to 1 okay this is a way you can able to execute the multiple threads based on the thread priority okay if you have any doubt regarding the thread priority then you can ask me at any time thank you thank you all for watching my videos